Hello. Hello, good afternoon, everybody. So today with Master Liu, today we're going to explain to you guys. This is the fourth time. Last week we did three times. This is the, mm. uh, the first time in this new week. So yes. this time we're going to explain to you guys the year from 2016 to 2017 about the MacBook. Mm. So the uh, circuit for the T1 model, for T1 model, yes. the uh, five, five voltage to 20 voltage. What's the problem mm. with the, why is only the five voltage, right? Yes. So the second thing we're going to share about the method of quickly repairing this issue. Then the third topic explain the quick repair method of mm. 2016 to 2020 MacBook Pro or Air not displaying. So this is mm. the third stuff we're going to talk about, the fourth is going to be the um, QE time, the question and the answer time. Yes. So let's get started. Mm. So you want to mm. play the video? Uh, we start from the video? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, perfect. We're going to start with the video. So so you can see this model is uh, A1706, only the fine voltage. Okay, only the fine voltage. So now you use the, uh, this version to test the uh, motherboard. Oh, now I tell you the, about the T1 model. Stop. Shall we stop yeah. the video again? Okay. Yes. Stop the about video. the T1 model, okay. the control the fine watt to 10 volt the socket. So it goes to the the board, mm -hmm. okay? Yes. Perfect. It goes to the board, okay. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. You want to see the ball? Hello? Don't tell me. Hmm. Yeah. Hello? Can you see the... Can you guys see the... Yes, we can. Hmm? Yes, it's okay. It's okay, bro. It's okay? It's okay, no problem. Just go ahead. Here, I can see this clear here. It's okay, no problem. Don't worry about it. It's okay, don't worry. This is the uh, the network of your... Okay, okay. So okay. this is about the true T1 model. 2016, 2017, to use the T1, T1 mm -hmm. course. T1 okay. model? T1, yes, T1 model. T1 model, uh, to use the T1 trip, T1 trip. Mm -hmm. T1 trip, yes. Okay, T1 trip. So you can see the T1 trip, which, which one is a T1 trip? I use the multiple, so you see the multiple on the T1 here. Hey, this is uh, A17, A1706 and A1707 uh, is about a T1 model. Okay, T1 model. So they use the T1 chip. Okay, use the T1, which I write down the T1 model. So T1 is from 2016 mm. to 2017 and 2008, oh no, 2018 T2. Yes, 2016 to 2017 is the T1 model. Okay. T1 model is uh, this one. Uh, A1706 and uh, A1707, two model. Okay, use the T1 trick. Now, show you the T1 trick in the model. You can see this one. Mm -hmm. Okay, you can see the T1, T1 chip. T have the Apple logo in the multiple. Okay, in here. These are A1707. This one here. See this one is a T1. You can see with this black here. Hey, this Apple logo. Apple logo. Can you see? 
Dan sila ibu logo. Mm-hmm. It's okay. I cannot see the Apple logo, but so where is the Apple logo? Yeah. Ah, it's very okay. It's very light. It's okay because I can see that from the. Uh, no, it's from the from the camera. It's kind of it's kind of hard to see that. Okay. But I can see that directly with my eyes. Oh, it's okay, don't worry. I saw that. I saw that. It's okay. Yes. It's yes, T1 the, model, yes. Yeah, this is a T1 chip. Okay, so the T1 chip, now tell you about the T1 chip socket. So from the 2016 to 2017, to use the T1 model. T1, I see this chip to control the uh, T1. T1 chip control the which one control the camera control the camera and the touch part okay tear touch part and the uh, fingerprint touch ID okay and the touch ID okay touch ID this I see to control the one two three four or one two three camera touch part touch ID okay camera touch ID bar and touch ID and uh, now I tell you about the fine wall. 220 watt. No, this model to use the USB C, USB C connector. Okay, connector. So USB C connector to have the fine wall, both 220 watt. Okay, this socket. Okay, this socket. So sometimes only the fine voltage, only the fine voltage. Maybe the problem from where? This one. Fine voltage push to 10 watt, which I see controlled. First one is a uh, USB C. Okay, USB C chip. USB C. This one is a uh, the net CD three two one five. Hey, this I see. This I see, and the next one is uh, which I see control the this I see and the charger I see. I S L. Okay, and the charger I see. It's a charger I see. And the number three is about the SMC. Okay. So one, two, three, three chips together control the fine wall push to 10 D volt. Okay, fine wall to 10 D volt. So sometimes uh the C D switch one five, this I see not working. All the charger I see not working, or the SMC not working, then just the fine voltage. Okay, so now today I use the uh this one S U E M I M2 S U E M2 to quickly to find the problem from the fine wall socket. Okay, from the connector, from the USB C connector to find the problem. Okay, from the USB C this connector to find the problem. Do not see the video about the USB C connector first. So continue the video, right? Yes, continue the video to see the this one problem. Then I'll tell you the uh, one by one. So now you see the this one uh connect to the yeah, connect the this cable. Okay, select the this cable. So this is the cable we're gonna connect. Yes. Right? Okay. Oh uh, yeah, you see the motherboard. Wait, you see that this motherboard. See that this motherboard. Okay. Use the uh, this one camera. The camera is over there, right? Oh, okay. This camera to see the Just motherboard. The okay. Yeah, yes, this one. You can see this motherboard is a T1 model. So sometimes you connect the power. Okay, as example, I connect this power. Okay, connect the, this one power. Power cable. Okay, find the this one power cable. This one power cable. Okay, connect the uh this one power cable from the table C. This connector, connect the power. Then you can see the voltage and the current. Okay, I voltage. I see the voltage and the current over there. Yeah, right? yes. Okay. Okay, connect the power cable. 
then you see the voltage. So sometimes you see the just the fine voltage, fine voltage. Maybe you can sometimes you connect this cable, get this connector, connect the table C, you see the just the fine voltage. So the problem from the multiple. Before I tell you the CD's USB C trick and the charger I see. Okay. Hello. It's okay, don't worry about it. Go ahead. Go ahead. It's okay, yeah, go ahead, go ahead. Okay, okay. So connect the, uh, this power cable. You see the current and the voltage. Okay, just the fine wall. That's the fine wall. So now you use the, uh, this one. Uh, use the CSUMI2 to test the connector. You can use the, this one to test the connector first. You can see. Test the connection. Sometimes the connector, the die radio, and normal. Maybe you have the short socket, so you can find the problem very fast. Okay, as example, this one. You can see, you can see the uh, number. Yes, I can see that. Don't worry. Okay, yeah. you can see. Uh, this one A one seven zero six and the A one seven zero seven. Uh, this or T one model. I also have the T two model. Okay, the T two model. So now you see that this one A one seven zero six. Okay, then you see the which one connector J three three zero and the JB five zero zero is the right side. Okay, this the right side here. Okay, this is the right side here. This one. This connector is a right, and the left. This one is a left. Okay, this is a left connector. So you want to test the uh, J three three zero. You connect this connector. Okay, so you test the, this one and uh, this side connector. So you can see clean here. This uh, this one is a uh, normal die value. Okay, this one. Oh, it's a normal die video. So sometimes you take the, the die video, have the short socket, or the die video is abnormal, so you can very fast find the problem. Now, continue to see the video. So continue with the video, right? Okay, yeah. let's continue with the video. Mm. Now, connect to this side, connect to this connection. Then, test the die video. You can see, check the, this one, the left, okay, left. Then you can see the check the result here. This one. So you can see on the, oh, you can see on the, on the screen uh, because BD3, of the. Uh, mm -hmm. Yes, BD3, The normal type is the uh, five hundred seven, seven. Uh, yes, seventy seven. But now, just the uh, four. 43. You can see the diameter just the 43. Ah, so the normal one is like 53. Normal mm. one is 53. Yes. So it's like, uh, so the normal is like 53, but you see it's like 400. Just the 40, 40 uh, 43. Yes, normal is a uh, 570. Oh, it's normal is like 577. Yes. So, but it's like a, it's not. And normal. It's not normal. So yeah. we can see this is the where the mm. problem is. Yes. Yeah. So okay. now you can open the uh for example you can open the four way or open the schematic. You will find the So we have to go to the schematic. Yes. It goes to the screen yes. and yes. okay. You can see my screen. Okay, as a number. So at this moment you have to use a computer. Mm. Yes. First thing we use the box. First, we use the box, so we test it. Oh, so if we see, there is the abnormal value. Mm, yes. 
and then we have to go we have to go to the scan unit to mm -hmm. see where the problem problem yeah. is scan okay and uh for where you can see wire pass from the uh now open the uh for where you see the this number uh this model is a a1706 and so now open the this for where then you see the problem is uh, from the this connection left okay J3300. Okay, left. The which one is a normal? It's a number. Which one P? You can see again. You can see that. See that this video. Okay. You can see this video again. Uh, number 153. Number 53. Other yes. pin. Yes, pin. We have to see the pin number. Yes, pin 153. Okay. So you okay. We one. have to see the 53. Mm. So it goes to the 53. Yes. 53. Okay, no problem. Yes, now you see that this 53 to connect to which I see here. Okay, 53 to goes to, to this I see. U3100. Yes. 3100. Okay. This I see. So the problem from this two. From this two. So now continue. You see the video. Okay. So now you see that this one, you see the video. Oh, well, now you find the problem. Now open the big man or open the footwear to find the uh, this one connector from here. Yes, you connect the, this this tray U three one zero zero. Okay, U three one zero zero. So now I use the air gun to remove. You, this you have to remove it. Okay. Yes, remove the chip. So, mm. the, this is the U3100, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. U3100. So, we take it off? Yes, tear off. Then you have to replace another yes, one, right? Replace, we have to replace the, another one? Mm, replace the other one. No, I replace the other one too. Okay, replace finish. So, test again the die value. Okay. So, just to use this box, we mm. test it. We see some. Abnormal mm. value, mm. then we replace. Mm. We see the pin number. Yeah, okay, now it's normal. we stop. Mm -hmm. So I go here, right? Okay, so here, right? It's here. No, no, that's fine. So be. Mm -hmm. Test. Then Testing? See the, yes. Yeah. Now okay. It's, uh, number. Oh, uh, between three is uh, normal. So five hundred eighty-six. So five seventy-seven. Mm. Now it's like five eighty-six. Yes. So it's very similar. Mm. Then yes. it's, it's okay. Yes. It's so okay. if it's very before, far away, far from before, the uh, before the this one, one, just the uh, yes forty-three. Yes, no, just the forty-three. So forty-three is a uh, normal. Now, okay. You see that this one is a. Uh, we continue. Yes. Okay, we continue. So now you can see the this one connect the power. Now connect the power. Now we connect it with the power. Mm. To see how okay okay. Yes. So, so you can see the here is like twenty four digits here. Mm. It's not yes. uh, it's not five anymore. Yes. Okay, perfect. So can you watch? So so this about the uh, use the this one to test the. Multiple. So it goes to the screen? Uh. No, it's okay. I can everything's perfect man. Mm -hmm. Don't worry. Okay. So this one, uh, you can see. Now introduce the uh, uh, this one. You wanna go? Check. You wanna go this one? Mm -hmm. So yeah. you want me to show them this? Mm -hmm. So, so this is the box. Mm -hmm. We're gonna use this box with the three cables, right? Mm -hmm. Mirror. Now it's okay. Yes. <laughs> Because it's okay. Now it's okay. 
you were like the you guys have like different motors on it and like three three cables so one two three so this is the product we were using for solving this problem okay we go we go we go to another video or what else yes oh sorry you can see the, the second topic the, uh, yes talking about the, uh, the socket first this one's okay It goes to the, the, the board, right? Okay. Board is number three. Okay, here we go. Mm. So, you can see the, about the... Uh, Don't worry. Yes. So the the, the quality is very the, good. Quality uh, very good. I want to tell you about the USB-C. USB-C, this model, you see the video, it's about the A1, this one, CD3215. Okay, the problem from the uh, number P, this one, P53. P53? Yes, P53. Mm -hmm. T, the time video, I don't know, just uh, 40, 43. The normal. It's a uh, 577. Yes, 577. You can see this signal in the in the schematic. This name is uh, which one you can see the video. Uh, see the this one. See this one. The name in the schematic is uh, this one. USB C S A C C two. So the CC2, CC1, or CG2 have the problem, no boost you can give up, okay, remember. So you also you can see from the, uh, no, not always the schematic, find this I see. U3, this one, uh, U3, 1, G, G. So you guess the schematic, you... Yeah. Search yeah. U3100. Yeah, that's right. Then you can see the problem is from here. USB C, S A C C 1, or C C 2. Here, C C 2. C C 2. USB C, S A C C 2. Have no problem. This one. So, remember, sometimes the no boost to 10 watt. Okay, no boost to 10 watt. Just a fine watt. You use the digital to, to test this connection first. USB C connector. Okay, maybe you can find the problem very fast. Furthermore, you test that this connector is normal. Okay, as an example, okay, you test this one connector. All the diameter, all the pin is normal, so the problem from here. From the USB C chip. Okay, this one, USB C chip. Oh, chart and see. AL charger and C, the working connection, or the SMC. So now you match the one by one the working connection. Because just the CD switch one by all charger and C, or the SMC, the working connection is normal. Then SMC control the USB C chip, control USB C chip. Then it goes to one volt to ten volt. Okay, goes to five volt to ten volt. So you must remember. This one, okay. You use the first one, use the this choose to test the connector. Connector, the diving value is normal, then you choose the, this one. One, two, three. I see because you can see connector, the diving value is normal, also just the fine voltage. Yes, okay. Mm. Uh, let's let's I want to mm. ask. So, first of all, we use this tour, mm. we use this green box, okay. First of all, we use this green box to test. We connect to the board, mm. we test it, we mm. test the board. Mm. If you see a value which mm. is not abnormal, which mm. is not a, it's not a, it's far away from the normal number. Mm. For example, this one is 43, but normal mm. one is 577. Mm. So we can go, we can go directly to the problem and fix it. Mm. If everything is normal, mm. but it still is five voltage, it mm. doesn't, it doesn't get started. I mean, it doesn't boot. Yes. So we have to go. We have to go to check the the rest of the mm. 
the chips SMC, mm. ISN 9239, also yeah. CD 3215. Yeah. So we have to go ahead, mm. continue to check the rest of those three chips. Yeah. So okay, check, perfect. Check the, check the, uh, working so we use the scam, scam ID or to yeah. so check the working, the working, yeah, yeah, yeah. So working condition? Yes, yeah. so that's scam ID. Okay. And, uh, Oh, the display problem. Yes, okay, first. Display problem. So the next one is about the showing the display problem. The display problem. So this one USB C. Finish. Okay, USB C. You remember one, two, three. I see. Tip controller. One more. Two can do more. Okay. I watch you can do what you just need to test the connector. Connector is normal, then check the IC working connection. Connector and normal, you can find the problem from the uh, schematic or from the model. They were the bus to okay. The so first, we have to check the connector, mm -hmm. make sure yeah, the yeah. connector is okay because this mm -hmm. is the if the connector is not working mm -hmm. uh, correctly, mm -hmm. we maybe we change it or we just re weld it, we yeah, just put yeah, it. Yeah. Well, we take it off and put it back, then that's yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. So very fast. To find the problem. Next, next step, we go mm -hmm. to the, with the, this green box and it goes to the check the value. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Check the IC. If it's working okay, then it goes to the, mm -hmm. the IC to see the working condition. Yeah, yeah. Okay, yes. perfect. So, this is about the uh, final watch. Now, I'll tell you the, about the display problem. Okay, this one finished. This what what do you mean by not displaying? So, mm. if it's only by four digits, it will not display. It will not. No, no. The we, five it will not work, right? Yes, not power one. Five voltage is not power one. Display is uh, you see. Ah, the display is power on. It's like yeah, twenty power. voltage, but mm. there is no image on yeah, the screen. Yeah, yes. no okay. Image. No, no image in the screen. Yes, right. So the problem is uh, number two. First one is uh, five volt to twenty volt. Number two is uh, the current uh, is uh, 10 G volt, right? First to 10 G volt, then turn on, okay? You hold on. Hold on, then you see the multiple working current. Okay, the working current is normal. Working current. Okay, while the working current is normal, but no display. Okay, no display. So how to repair the this one problem? You see, connect the power, 10 volt is okay, then you can power one, and then you see the working current, see the multiple current is normal, but no display. Okay, no display. It's about the what problem? So now you I use the this multiple to show the current. So power on working mm. current, then normal, but no display. Yes. Okay. So the multiple is working normal, but not display. And you see, I use uh, this multiple to, as an example, you see the current. I connect the power. This is a T2, okay? T2, T1 is same. T2, T1, the current is in. Now I connect the, uh, uh, like this one. Connect the power. Okay, now you see the current for the this one. Number two. Okay, you see the current in okay, this one. This uh I'm not connected kind of multiple. You can see this one, or you can from the uh this cable. See the current, see, okay, this current, this current. 
For example, you don't have the DC power supply, you can use the uh, Table C charger. You can use the, this charger connect the, this connector to see the current. Okay. Sometimes you don't have the DC power supply, so you can use the Table C charger to connect this connector to see the current. Okay, so see the current. So now you see the this multiple. <laughs> Uh, this is about the multiple working current. You can see T can boost to 20 watts. Now you see the T boost to 20 watts. So it's already connected. Yes. T boost to and it volt. goes to mm. goes up to power 20 volts. 20 yes. volt each. Then the power ones. Okay. Yes. It means the motherboard is already it's it's working. I mean the motherboard yes. is working. Okay. Yes. No, the motherboard is working. Mm. But not display. You connect the uh, uh, screen, no image. Okay, you see again, see again the current, that the connect the power, see again the current. See again, this one. Yeah. Now, T goes to 20 watt. Okay, goes to 20 watt, then T power one. Power one, you can see, now you see the, the current is uh, working, working normal. Okay, jump is no, but not display. So not display from problem from the display connector. Okay, remember see the current. Okay, so now you see that this current is normal, but this one is normal, but not display. <coughs> now you find a problem from the uh, display connector. Find the problem from the display connector. So now you can use the also use the these tools. Okay. <clears throat> to test the display connector first. EDP is about the EDP display connector. Okay, EDP connector. J A one zero zero. Now you see see the this one video. Okay, the next one video. Okay. Yeah, it can be. It boosts your ten I'm working. Current is normal. Okay, working current are, is normal. Yeah, mm -hmm. yes. Now I use the this one to test the the multiple. Okay, test the select the EDP EDP connector. Okay, EDP connector. Now. Test this one. Connect the uh not connect the power. Mm -hmm. okay, connect connect power. power. You see the current, okay, is normal, right? It's, it's a normal. jump, yes, mm -hmm. normal. So the multiple working is normal. Mm -hmm. Then you disconnect the power and okay, use the this tools to test the EDP. And this uh EDP connector. So we turn it turn it on. Mm, yes. Now select this number. This one is a uh, okay. You can see this multiple is uh, about the T two T two T one. The repair method is same way. Connect power select uh, now. This one. You see you select the A one night A night. Even not in that, the multiple, multiple number. Okay, so number this is the this, uh, the the uh, model is the uh, A one night A night. Okay, this one model. So now continue. See the this one select. Then you select the EDP. And then you select the, and you select the number, is uh, this one, node is similar. Then you select the EDB again, remember, to test the EDB connector. So now you select the EDP. Then you connect the EDP. EDP. Yes. You EDP. mean the cable? Oh, uh, yes. Cable, the name is all the EDP, and the connector in the multiple is uh, EDP. Now we get EDP. Mm, you see this one. 
So you can see the multiple connector is uh, this connector. So this connector is uh, mm. J8500 yes. EDP? Yes. Okay. And the uh, connector is uh, this one connector. Video, continue video? Uh, see the, this connector. Wait. See the, this connector. Okay. It's here. Mm. Yes. Okay. Mm. Start with you. So now you test uh, this EDB connector, then you see the which one is the normal here. Ah, okay. Mm. So number this is a pin one and pin number three. pin one and pin. Okay, pin one and pin pin one. Yes, pin one. Pin one is a normal. Normal is a. Uh, uh, 238. 238. Yes. So it's only 52. Yes. The, but now you test uh, is the only the 15 two. 15 two. So it's 52. So that's so the issue. The, we yes, have to go to Scammity to see the P1 yeah. or? Yes. You can see. Uh, the, yes. Okay. Yes. Uh, the it goes to the, the board. Okay. EDP. From the EDP connection. This one. EDP. The J A one zero zero, A J one zero zero. This E D V connector. Use the this tool to test the E D V connector. Now you test the pin one. Yeah. Pin one. The direct just the eighteen two. Okay. The normal. The normal is a two two hundred thirty eight. This one is normal. But now you test just the eighteen two. So. The diameter and normal. You can open the uh schematic or oh, the board wheel. Now you can see. Mm -hmm. Open open the uh schematic to see the see the, this one. And then open the uh schematic. So uh now this is about the T two okay T one T two the socket switch. And now open the T two model. A one night, A night. Yeah, this is a schematic. Okay, this is a board wire. You can see the pin one. This is the EDB okay, uh -huh. e connector. This is the EDB connector. So the pin one is the, this one. Pin one. You see, it connect to where? Connect to CPU here. This pin. So this marble is a CD CPU image. Okay, this is about the connection CPU. So this is uh, about the CPU damage. CPU damage. CPU is damage. Yes, CPU because CPU is short. The connection CPU then this tire is uh, short. Okay, tire is short. So this is uh, CPU. Okay, CPU damage. Uh, see the video, continue. Mm -hmm. Let's continue with the video. Mm. Okay. Now also you can open the uh, board wire. Yes. But where to find the uh, pin one? J five thousand, eight thousand five hundred. Mm. Okay. Pin one. Okay. Pin one. It goes yeah, to U. Go to the CPU. U zero five hundred. This is CPU. So, so sometimes you can see the current. It's normal, but no display. So about the CPU, but you must find a problem. Okay, you can see here, this one. Video, run the video. Video is over. You can see the. Ah, this no. part, okay. Can you see the video? Okay, now this is a CPU. So, now you remember to test or uh, uh, repair the marble about the no display. Mm -hmm. 
here. So for the node display, this one. Okay. From the EDV connection, okay, to test to test the diameter. But you must show the current is normal. Okay. Sometimes the bottom of the current no jump, only the top one because for them the current. This one is normal current, only the 0, 0, 0.85 or 0, 0, the one, one, uh, one six or the other the current is no and normal. So the problem is about the power one socket problem. Now it's a working current is normal. Okay, normal. Then you check the problem from the discrete connection. Okay, this one is so different. Current and normal. Maybe the power one socket problem. You must repair the power one socket. Current is a uh, Normal for no display to the EDB display connection. Okay, so this one over there. And sometimes this one current. Uh, remember the T1 or T2. The 30 inch. Okay, 30 inch. This one. Maple Pro. Okay, Maple Pro 30 inch. Okay, Maple Pro 30 inch. Sometimes you see the current. So this one. Uh, power one for them the standby to power one zero point two eight says then standby the power one restart okay this one also the problem is uh, from the EDB connector standby power one standby restart you can also you can use the, this one to test the EDB connector sometimes also the maybe the pin one pin three and the pin 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 seven pin have the problem. So this one is short. This was CPU damage. CPU damage. Yes, CPU damage. Because this pin to go to the CPU, CPU low down the diameter to this one. So CPU damage. Okay, CPU damage. So this is about the 30 inch. Okay, 30 inch. See that this current. Also, you can test the EDB connection. Sometimes you see the current is normal, but not display. You can test the display connection from the EDB. Mm. Yes. So this is about the uh, display connector from the EDB to test to find the problem. Yes. One use the digital. You can test the uh, five volt boost to twenty volt. Sometimes no boost to twenty volt. Also, you can find the problem very fast. The number two, no display. Also use the these tools to test the uh, display connection. Can okay, find the problem. Okay, yeah. let me mm -hmm. let me repeat. Let's say if I have learned well in this mm -hmm. in this course, okay. Mm -hmm. So first of all, we were talking about mm -hmm. uh, the five voltage. Yes. So if if it is only five voltage, it means the motherboard is not uh, mm -hmm. is not a I mean, this the whole process, or it's not booted. It's not no boot, right? Mm, yes. So we have to check. Mm. First of all, we have to check the connector. Yes. Right. right? Yes. We have to we have to make sure the connector is working mm. well. Yes. If the connector is working well, mm. we have to use the we have to use the use this toward the green box. Mm. Connect it. Mm. Then we see that if the value is normal. Mm. If the value is normal. Uh, normal. If it's normal, then we goes to the. Uh, I mean, the value is normal. Mm. Then we go. We go to the schematic. Ah, uh, there is the yeah. schematic. If it's yeah. not normal, I mean, mm. it's not normal. We go to the schematic. We find a problem. Mm. Yeah. If it is normal, we go to the three pieces of the the mm. chips you were talking mm. right yeah, yeah, yeah. on the video. So that was the three pieces of the chips. We have to check it. Mm. Yeah. Right. Okay. The second thing we are talking about. The uh, the working voltage mm. is okay. I mean, it goes to twenty voltage. Yes. The the motherboard booted, mm. but there is no display, mm. no display. So this is this is what you wrote on the board. Power on. Mm. So we check the working current. Everything was okay. Mm. Then we also use the this tour, mm. the green box to check the EDP connector, yes, the EDP connector. to see where. Is the problem the problem mm. is so if we see there is some abnormal value mm. the value is not normal mm. then we go to the scanning 
to say where the problem is, right? Yeah. Yeah. Say problem is pin one, pin one goes to the CPU, mm -hmm. or maybe it's pin two, I don't know, maybe yeah, different yeah. pin to set up yeah. issues. Okay. Yeah, yeah. And you were talking about that, and then I think about T1, T2, 13 inches, yes. and the working current. Yes. This part I didn't understand very well. So this could you explain? Is, uh, the, uh, sometimes you see that this current T can power one, but power fire. Power? Fire. Two. Fire? Yes. Power fire is, uh, is uh, not, you can see, just jump to the 0 0.2, then you restart, restart. Uh, the, it's like restart or reboot all the time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Restart, restart, restart the all the time. Normal. The power fire. So, this one problem also you can use the uh, EDP to test the display connection. Maybe sometimes the CPU also CPU damage. This one, the current restart, restart. Ah, you mean that the, the, the computer is mm -hmm. able to restart, 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 restart. Then we yeah. can use this tour. Mm -hmm. We can use this... Uh, the green box we were talking, you can use this green box to test uh, EDP. Yes, also from we, the we check we, we check it EDP. Yes, this one display connection. Okay, which one? Uh, display this one. It's okay. Uh, Maybe this one. Ah, uh, we display. check the connector. So we connect. Yeah. We put a we connect display with the. Uh, yeah, we use the box. We connect the connector yeah. to see where see the value. Now. We see yes. the value on the mm. screen. Yes. So the value is normal, mm. we check another thing. If it's not yeah. normal, mm. we use the schematic, we yeah. go to the uh, mm. the right spot to check yeah. where the problem is. The problem. Okay, the connection, where it goes, mm. to CPU, to the other chips. Yes. Okay, Sometimes we replace it, we fix the problem. Mm. Yes, right. Okay, this is what I, I understood. I hope you guys understand as well. Yes. Have there another uh, uh, have there a question about the, this one? The USB C uh, USB C connector or the display connector? Have there a problem? So we mm. so, I think we have already there are like three topics we have already uh, mm. explained everything, right? We have to first we we explained. Okay, let's go to the uh, mm. so first of, first we were we explained to five forty to twenty the mm. circuit okay. issues. Yes. Then we shared the method of uh, how to quickly, quickly repairing how to repair mm. this issue. One to quickly okay, to we use this the tour connector first. Mm -hmm. Then you should the uh, the IC. Three I see to check that. So okay. you check this one. When you find the problem, you can very fast. For example, you test that this one have the short socket or the die value and normal. Then you open the four wire to find the which switch. Okay, to replace the this switch, then you can solve this one problem. So very quickly to finish this one problem. But you said first of all we have to check the connector. So yes. first, first, first we check the connector, or first we we connect it with this with this box. Uh, you connect the power. See, the only five volt. Now you connect this box to test the connector. To test the can with this one, we also can can test the connector. Yes, test the, this one. The so we put them video. together. Yes. First, the first one video test the, this one connector. Uh huh. USB C, one side and this side, two sides to see the. That video. To okay. see that? That video. That video. You can see the that first video. one. video. Yes. That video. You can see the first one video. Okay. I, because I, I want to understand mm. a very, I want to understand this. So let's go to number, number three one, one more time. Yes. So see, again, this one video. Now you see that that's the right? Wait. It's 500. Yes. No boost? Yes. No boost. Then we connect. So now you use the, this one. We use to this tool. To test the uh, USB-C connector. Mm hmm Let's shoot this one to test. So let me see this mm -hmm. clear. So you connect okay. uh, with the ball. This one. Connect it to test. Oh, you select the, uh, this one is a uh, left. Oh, you, so you, you can see the right or left? Yes. You tell that this one is uh, a normal. You can see it's this not, pin. Uh, it's not normal. Pin 3 and normal. So now you open the uh, ball where to Find this pin to connect the uh, 53. Mm. 
to connect to this IC U3100. So this is damage. So this is damage. This is damage. Now you replace this chip. Then you can solve the problem. Now you replace the chip. We replace the chip mm. and we fix the issue. Yes. So now we connect, we check the value again. We check the value again. Okay, now the value is everything is correct. Okay. Then we connect again. Then the bot will be boosting. Yes. So this okay. one is very fast to repair this one problem. So this is the second one. I just yeah. want to... It's about a display. Okay, this is about the, the voltage is correct. It's 20 volt. So about that, this the voltage is correct. Then we connect. It goes to the right. Okay, we use this box. This is the box we were we are using. We goes to the EDP. So this is the EDP. This is the cable, EDP cable and J eight thousand five hundred. We goes to the this scammy. We see the we find a chip. Okay, it goes. With this, okay, here is the uh, mm. the pin, right? Yes. So we have to also replace the chip, right? Yes. Repair the CPU. So if uh, the CPU, we can repair the CPU or yes. just replace it? Replace, replace the CPU. Replace, just to change another change. one. Yeah, okay. Change. Okay, this video is, was, it was over, it was suddenly all very... <laughs> Very fast, doom. It's like yeah. stop. So Perfect. Yes. Okay, so I think we have explained the both issues. If it's not a boot, if it's boot and it's a five voltage, how uh, we need to we can solve the issues. If it's twenty, how we're gonna solve the issues? So I think we have explained. Uh, Everything that uh, actually uh, to you guys, uh, I think the training or the course is over.